Hey YouTube, Rene here again uh, with another multi-pipe restoration project. Uh, this time I'm going to attempt um, to restore these three, you know, relatively small billiards. Uh, they're small looking um, because, you know, they're seconds, no-name brands and stuff like that. Um, but they really aren't that small. I mean, the bowls are, you know, they're pretty good pretty good size bowl it's just that they're just small you know um a bit small i guess for today's market you know where you know a, a, a bigger thicker bulkier pipe is now you know what's popular instead of these little little bad boys here who you know unfortunately um yeah no one really wants so what i do is of course i showed you guys this this Basically, what I do, I get these little pipes here and I Frankenstein them. You know, make them what I believe. Um, I make them more marketable, if you will, in today's market, um, more more appealing. And that's what I'm going to do here. First off, we have this nice little billiard. This is a no-name brand. Uh, at least I can't find a name on it. All I can see here, and I won't be able to show you with my camera, but. Right there it says, Genuine French Briar, made in France. And uh, the bit has a logo, I just can't make out what it is. You know, uh, once I ink it in, if, if, I, if it's possible for me to ink it in, I'll, uh, I'll see, you know, what it is. Maybe I can figure it out. Uh, this pipe here has issues, of course. It's got that crater there, and then it has a hairline fracture. Well, not a fracture, just a crack. Right there, you can see it. But taking the uh, taking the bit off, uh, you can see that the that crack is not a fracture. It doesn't doesn't go all the way through. So you know we're in good shape. If anything, um, <clears throat> what I will do here, uh, so I won't have to fill that in, and you know there there's no way that I can really fill that in unless I make it bigger. So if, if anything, what I'm just probably going to end up doing is just rusticating it. Uh, just putting some kind of rustication on it to uh, blend this in and fix that. Um, the next one is a Frank Medico. It's a nice little, uh, you know, saddle bit billiard. Um, this is a, uh, of course, being that it's a Medico, it's uh, the bit again with these pipes. These three pipes have just pristine bits. Uh, but the pipe itself is very nice. Uh, this one here appears to have, you know, kind of, kind of okay grain, but it's got cosmetic issues, of course. <clears throat> so this one, I won't really know what I'm going to do here until I sand it down and, you know, find out what the what the real grain looks like. Now this one here, this last this last one is a King's Cross. Uh, I've come across these uh, pipes before. I'm not sure, but I believe uh, one of you guys told me, and please don't hold me to this because I'm not exactly sure, but I believe someone someone said King's Cross is um, it's made by, I believe, Savinelli, I think. I don't know. I might be wrong about that. Um, at any rate, it's a King's Cross. <laughs> and um, again, very nice pipe. And, to be perfectly honest with you, I mean, it's not a, you know, it's not a small bowl, to be perfectly honest with you. It's, it's got, you know, nice sized bowl. It's just, you know, the it's a thin bowl, so it makes it look small, so it's a small pipe. But the bit is pristine on it, and um, kind of really tough to open, which is bad, but that can be fixed. But it's a very good bit, just almost brand new, if you will. Uh, and the pipe itself has, of course, issues, but they're just cosmetic, which, of course, you know, I'll be able to fix. This actually has very nice grain here, very nice bird's eye here, uh, but then it just, it washes out right here. There's just nothing there. Maybe a little bit of flame, but nothing really, you know, attractive, if you will. So, I don't know what I'm going to do with this one. I'm sure I'm going to try to save that and uh, maybe, who knows, maybe do something different here. Oh, so it's just rusticated in some way, you know. In some way, just bring the rustication around. I don't know. We'll see. 
So anyway, guys, that's it. Um, and of course, as I go along, um, hopefully I won't make too many videos uh, when it comes to this. I'll just, you know, show you um, how I've rusticated them, what I've done to fix the problems once it's already done, and then I'll show you the, the end result. So it'll just be three videos. Um, just, you know, not to make just that many. Um, you know, bore you guys too much. All right, compadres, comadres, as always, thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, con Dios.